King, and today is going to be a new video, uh, and as you can see, I have shorter hair. Yeah, I got a haircut on Friday, and it's really short, and I like it, and yeah. Um, so today I'm going to be doing a video on what to expect in 8th grade, because a lot of you guys have been requesting, um, but before I get to the video, I have gotten a request by a fellow YouTuber and also a friend of mine, um, Hannah, or Hannah by Design, you all should check her out, she is amazing. Um, she has a question for me and she wants me to answer it online, on a YouTube video, and I am going to do it. Uh, so the question is, when's your wedding with Martin Thurman? Um, okay, so there is this thing going on a while ago that... Um, no, I'm not going to even say, but I don't know if there's ever going to be a wedding, Hannah. Um, Caitlin, Hannah, all of you lovely friends of mine, I don't think there's going to be a wedding. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, we have to go our separate ways. Um, okay, that was awkward. Anyways, yeah, I'm going too quickly. Yeah. Okay, so first things first, um, actually a viewer of mine uh, kicked me a couple days ago and apparently really liked my videos and he is from the UK so that's pretty cool. I have viewers from the UK and I really want to say thank you all for watching and just quick shout out to those uh, who are watching but um, no, without further ado, let's get on with the video. Uh, so. First things first for me, uh, the most important thing in my 8th grade year was my grades because I was going into a private high school, I was applying for one, so I had to have exceptional grades, but otherwise, even if you're not going to a private high school, if you're going into the high school that your middle school students go to, you still want to have good grades because the high school does look at your grades and base those grades off of what uh, classes you're going to go to in your freshman year so um, it would be good if you had not exceptional grades but good grades in general um, so that was the most important thing for me um, but also like number two um, teachers okay so teachers expect a lot more of you uh, in your eighth grade year because in sixth grade you were a little kid seventh grade you're still immature but when you go into 8th grade, they expect a lot more from you, and they try to get you prepared for high school. Um, so basically, they expect you to be mature. So it would be probably good somehow and some day in your 8th grade year, you turn into a mature, lovely person. But you don't have to. It's just going to be a bad thing for you. Um, but not only are they expecting more from you, um, they will not care like they're gonna start caring less about you if you don't want to work your butt off then they don't care they won't try to do anything so because of that try to get on their good side if you are not doing well in their class they will hopefully give you some extra credit if they like you so get on their good side um so number three so now that you are the big kids of middle school it's pretty sick. I know it's it was pretty fun in my school. We were called the trolls, the big, uh, the big cool kids of the school. Yeah. Um. So take advantage of it. Uh. Since you guys are the big kids, you want to have as much fun as possible. Um. But don't take too much advantage. Like, don't be so mean to the little like sixth and seventh graders, and be like, oh, you're you're so, you're so tiny. Or I don't even know. I wasn't really mean to them because. <laughs> I didn't really communicate with them, so yeah, um, but I mean, have fun, just don't be mean to the little ones, <laughs> so just take advantage of it, just don't take too much advantage, um, but overall, I mean, have fun, it's your last year before high school, the last year before things start to matter, so party all day and all night, which I did not do, yeah, I actually studied, hmm. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so enjoy your last year. It's going to be worth it. Um, and especially enjoy your graduation. Uh, that was for me the most important thing of 
my eighth grade year. Graduation and grad dance was pretty, pretty damn cool. Um, the graduation was fun. Um, it was it's cool to see everyone dress up. Some guys looking pretty sick. Yeah. But let's forget that. <laughs> so these are just a few tips of mine to um, like what to expect for your eighth grade year. Um, I know this is some of my little preferences, my tips that may not comply to you, um, but you guys asked for it and I've given it to you. Um, so yeah, uh, that's all for this video. Um, like this video if you enjoyed it. Um, subscribe if you want to see more uh, weekly videos from me. Um, and comment down below what you are scared for eighth grade. If those of you who are going into eighth grade, comment down below. Those of you who are already experienced eighth grade, tell me what was the scariest part while you're in eighth grade. Um, but yeah, otherwise, thanks so much for watching this video and I will see you in a couple days.